One of the biggest challenges for the Packers this season may be off the field. We'd like to be better, but I think we're, we've made a lot of progress. Head coach Matt LaFleur Friday acknowledging the team has yet to reach the NFL's goal of having at least 85% of players on each team vaccinated. All we can do is try to educate the guys and tell them the, the protocols and the ramifications of being unvaccinated. The NFL warning outbreaks could cause teams to forfeit games. Games canceled this season because of COVID won't be rescheduled and players won't get paid. Yeah, I think it's a concern. It's, you know, uh, the numbers are going back up. Packers President Mark Murphy this week not saying how many players are vaccinated, just noting it's a front office high priority. Well, I would say we, we have a ways to go. Yeah, and, we, and we're working on it. League-wide, the NFL says nearly 88% of all players have received at least one shot. How big of a deal is it for teams at this point to get to that 85% threshold? It will be completely critical for the teams to hit that 85% threshold rate. The stakes are high. Forfeiting one game can leave a, a team out of the playoffs. The NFL also noting 19 teams have more than 90% of players at least partially vaccinated. Seven teams, 95%. The Packers, at this point, not one of them. In Milwaukee, I'm Matt Smith, WISN 12 News. As part of an agreement with the Players Union, vaccinations are not required. Unvaccinated players must adhere to protocols like wearing masks and testing and will be fined for violations.